Hey guys, welcome back to Nextgen Block. And in this video, I want to show you how to use the preview range in Blender. Now, it's actually super easy to use the preview range in Blender. So, without further delay, let's get started and see how you can do this. Now, to demonstrate this, I've already created a small animation. So, let me quickly play the animation for you. Now, before I show you how to use the preview range, first let's talk about what is a preview range. So, the preview range is a subset of the timeline that you can play. So, right now, the animation starts at the first frame and ends at the 50th frame in the timeline. And if I play the animation, this is the order in which the animation is playing. It is starting at the first frame and ending at the 50th frame. But let's say I want to play the animation from the 15th frame to the 25th frame. In that case, what you can do is you can make use of the preview range. So first you need to enable the preview range by clicking on this icon which says use preview range. Next, you need to enter the start and end values. So inside start, let me write 15 and inside end, let me write 25 and now if I play the animation as you can see this time the animation is playing from the 15th frame to the 25th frame so this is how you can use the preview range to play a subset of the timeline and once you are done to disable the preview range what you need to do is you need to simply click on this icon once again and the preview range will be disabled. So, this is how you can use the preview range in Blender. Do let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. Like the video and subscribe to my YouTube channel. I will again see you in the next video. Till then, thanks for watching.